aku last week Okay, today we are going to learn about new thing Okay, the last uh, the last uh, week we have learned about communication Okay, how you can communicate after you observe something How you can communicate with teacher or with people around you Okay, you can Waalaikumsalam Asma We can uh, tell them orally, tell them Or uh, we can sketch them, we can draw or we can write about them, okay? We can write about things that we already observe, all right? When we're talking about observe in science, Zikri, <laughs> Zikri Ikram, do you want to join science class with teacher Diha as well, Zikri? <laughs> Zikri, do you have your class? Okay, so... For our, uh, for in science, okay, for observation, it's not necessarily you're going to use your eyes, your sense of sight only. If you touch, okay, for example, if you touch a book, okay, this is what we call okay, this observe. is five senses. Yes, five we senses. have, correct, we have five senses. Okay, if you touch using your hand, okay, we call this as observe as well. Okay, if you hear the sound, we call it as observe as well, using your sense of hearing. If you taste using your tongue, okay, we call it as observe as well. Yes, Arif, Arif, raise up your hand. Do you have anything to ask teacher, Arif? Ada apa-apa, boy. Ada apa-apa, tertekan. Okay, it's okay. All right. Yes. Yes. One. I'm. I'm this. Okay. So. Yes, Itra. Do you have anything to ask, teacher Itra? Yes. Um. The. The chat cannot. Keep yes, going. because I closed the chat box. Because I closed I'm, the chat box. I'm not done. Not done what? Chat box. Uh, teacher, close the chat box so that you can focus on my class first. Later, I will open it again. Okay, yeah. during your individual <laughs> self learning, we will open again. Thanks, Papa Captain. Yeah, yes, right. Okay. Um. No, I'm not checking the okay. chat box. Yeah, yeah, microphone off. Okay, everyone, as you know, the rules of our class is, the rules for online class is, you are not allowed to chit chat in the chat box when the teacher is talking, okay? So, later I will open the chat box when it's time for your individual self-learning. Now, focus for our class first. All right, can you show teacher thumbs up if you can see my screen? Can you show me thumbs up if you can see my screen? Alright, so before teacher continue with our class today, let's watch this video first about manipulative skills. Ah, what is manipulative skills? This is the topic that we are going to learn today, okay? Science manipulative skills. In order to be able to do science activities effectively, manipulative skills plan important role besides science process skills. Manipulative skills are psychomotor skills that enable us to carry out practical works in science. It involves the development of hand-eye coordination. There are five manipulative skills. Number one. Okay, so the manipulative skill is basically uh, the skill, the ability that you need to have when doing a science experiment. <laughs> Uh, microphone off, make sure your microphone off. All right. So, uh, even though we're not at school now, even though we cannot carry out our science experiment together with teacher, together with uh, your friend, it's okay. You just can uh, learn about the manipulative skill first today. And let's say if we have project based about science later, you can apply this manipulative skill. Okay. So, basically, 
manipulative skill is how you carry out the experiment. You have to handle, okay, the science apparatus. What is science apparatus? Later, we will see together, right? So what you need to know first, okay, before we continue with our class today, manipulative skill is your ability to handle the experiment correctly. Ah. Okay, the first one, use and handle science apparatus and substances. Later, teacher will uh, tell you what is meant by science apparatus and also substances. Okay, don't worry. Use and handle science apparatus and substances. <laughs> During an experiment, you need to know which appropriate instrument to use in certain situation and know how to read the scale on the instrument that is being used. Number two, handle specimens correctly and carefully. When you are handling plants, you should take only necessary plants to the lab and return them to its original place after using it. Do not handle poisonous plants without teacher's supervision as it is extremely dangerous. When the specimen are animals such as bugs, place them in petri dishes. If still alive, release them. Number three, drawing specimens and apparatus. When you are drawing, use a pencil and unlined paper. Draw at large so that important. Details can be seen easily. Draw on the left and labels on the right. Labels should be one. Under the other, you must use a ruler to draw lines for labeling and do not cross the line. Never shade or color the diagram. Okay, so this one, okay, for manipulative skill before this, right? Before this, we have learned about communication, where you can draw. Okay, wait, you will approve your friend to join. Yes. Yes. Yeah, I go to toilet. Yes, you may go. Okay, so before this, all right, we have learned that in our communication skill, uh, aside from sketching, you can uh, write, okay, about your observation as well. But for manipulative skill, you can just draw without coloring them, okay? It's fine. If you, are, if you want to draw but you don't want to color them, so it's fine, right? So if you need to color, okay, you need to use the correct color, right, for experiment that day. <coughs> and also the titles. Huh? Before this, we already practiced writing inside our Tatan book, okay? Whatever you want to write, whatever you want to draw, you need to have the title. Okay, you need to have the title so that if one day when you look back at your book, okay, when you want to do revision, for example, you will know, oh, this one is about science apparatus or, or this one is about science observation. That's why we need to have the title, okay? Uh, for example, you yourself have your name, right? You have your own name. So that is easier for teacher to call you, okay? So the same goes for your Tatan book, okay? Uh, it's the best if you write the title so that you know what is uh, the pictures, is all about, what is the writing, is all about, okay? Titles are compulsory and should be written at the top. Number four, cleaning science apparatus. During this process, you should clean all apparatus properly and carefully. Make sure to use the right cleaning method. For dirty glassware, soak them overnight. Clean and dry all. Okay, uh, so this one, actually teacher can observe, teacher can see how you are going to do this when you do experiment at school. But it's okay, uh, hopefully you guys can come back to school sooner that we can do. Yes? Mm -hmm. Who turn on the microphone? Do you have anything to ask, teacher? Okay. Uh, for yes. Uh, uh, hopefully, you guys can come back to school sooner. Then we can do the experiment together. Okay. Uh, so after you uh, after you already done with your experiment, what you need to do is you need to clean all the apparatus uh, properly and carefully. Okay, because most of the science apparatus most of the size stuff okay they are made up from the glass so, so you have to be careful ah, that's why it's written here make sure to use the right cleaning method 
protected. Ah, for dirty glassware, okay. Soak them overnight. Ah, you can leave them overnight before cleaning them tomorrow. Okay. Then after cleaning, what you need to do is ah, you need to dry all the apparatus before store them. Okay, before store them at the right place. Okay, you cannot just leave them on the table after you're done with your experiment. Okay, after you're done with your experiment, you need to wash them carefully, properly, then let them dry for a while. After they already dry, you have to take the science apparatus and Put them at the right place, okay? Storing, storing, uh, storing, <clears throat> storing means we put them back at their right place, okay? We put them back at their right place. Uh, put it where you take it before you use them, okay? Uh, put it back at their own place, right? Apparatus before storing. Number five, storing science apparatus. Return every apparatus used to its original location. Make sure every apparatus are dry. Before storing, follow storing procedures to store them. Okay. Teacher, teacher what is storing? Okay, just now teacher already told you storing, okay? Storing means you return every apparatus to its original location. Uh, put it back at its place. Uh, for example, okay? You want to wear uh you want to wear a blouse okay if you want to wear a blouse okay, sure, what put... return huh return return means put it back put it back when when balik, letak balik. Ah. <laughs> yes letak balik put it back letak balik ah put it back put it back at its original place ah huh? listen to the teacher listen to the teacher put it back Yes, correct. Thank you. Yes. Original. 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 Original means. Okay, ah, it's okay. Turn off the microphone. Turn off uh, your microphone. Okay, teacher will show you. Ah, who did not turn off the microphone? Ah, turn it off. Okay. Meaning of original place, okay? For example, if you take something, all right? If you take something, uh, for example, you take the uh, plate from the shelf. Okay, for example, if you take a plate from the shelf, okay, you take the plate for you to uh, put the rice and also put your lunch. And so after you're done eating, okay, uh, teacher want to ask, uh, Kisha, Kisha Rose, after you're done eating, what should you do with the plate? Put inside the sink. Put inside the sink. Okay, after you put inside the sink, what should you do? Wash. Wash them. Correct. Thank you, Kisha. Safwan, Safwan, can Safwan turn on the microphone? Yes. Okay, Safwan, after you wash them, what should you do? Put back. Ah, after you wash, what should you do? Put back. Put back. Before you put back, Inside the shelf, what should you do? Dry. Dry it first. Well done, Safwan. Good job. Okay, Amanda, can Amanda turn on the microphone? Amanda Shakila. Yes, teacher. Okay, just now, Kishara said after we already done eating, we have to uh, wash the plate. Uh, then Safwan said we have to let them dry first. Okay, after the plate is already dry, what should we do, Amanda? Put them back. Put them back where? In the cupboard. In the? Cupboard. Cupboard? It's a what? A carpet. Amanda, your friend is asking you, what is cupboard? Place where you store the plate? Uh, yes. Okay. Almari, okay. All right. Thank you, Amanda. 
All right. So uh, it's okay since we have 37 students here. So all of us did not have the same place where we can store our plate, right? So the first place where you take your plate just now is what we call original plate. Understand? Can you show teacher thumbs up if you can understand? Can you show teacher thumbs up if you understand? Okay. Thank you, everyone. What is the original? The original. Huh? Original plate. I original. Original. Ah, okay. Turn off the microphone. So teacher will tell you. Okay. Original, original place means where it belong. Ah, for example, your toys. May Afia Medina, can you turn on the microphone? Huh? Where did you store your toys, Afia Medina? Where did you store your toys? At the toys room. At the toys? When I was small, my brother just steal the toys without permission. So you store your toys in the toys room, Afia Medina, toys room, right? No, toys room. Toys what? <laughs> toys what, Afia, did you couldn't hear you clearly? Toy room. Toys room. Toy room. Toy room. Ah, okay. All right, thank you, Afia Medina, for your sharing, okay. So, ah, uh, let's say you store your toys inside a, a toys room, right? So, when you want to play, okay, the toys, you will take them, okay? So, after you're already done playing with the toys, you will return the toys to its room again, correct or not? Or you just leave it there? No, right? Yeah. You will collect all your toys, then put it back inside the toys room. So the toys room is what we call original place, where it comes from. Understand? Understand, everyone? Yes. Uh, yes. Okay. Alhamdulillah. Thank you for it. Yes. My yes. My house is really tall. Uh, another home. Another home? Uh, okay, Tara. Home is really tall. Really tall. Okay. At my hotel, hotel really tall than my my home. Ah, okay. So after this, you can share with teacher uh your your uh about your new home. Okay. So now let's continue first with our science class. All right. So uh just now we already seen a video about. Manipulative skills, okay? Manipulative skills. Ah, so can teacher have uh, a title? Yes. Ah, okay. Uh, Check your microphone, everyone. Astaghfirullah al azim. Who did not turn off the microphone? Okay, Atoy, can you turn on the microphone, Atoy? Yes, teacher, I'm here. Okay, Atoy, do you still remember what the teacher uh, told all of you about manipulative skill? What is manipulative skill? I can't remember. <laughs> you can't remember. It's okay. All right, thank you, Atoy. It's okay. All right, uh, just in case if all of you uh, did not remember what is manipulative skills, Manipulative skills is the ability ah, for you to do the experiment. How you want to do the experiment? No, uh, ability. Huh? Elevity. Ab ability. Uh, either you can do the experiment correctly or not. That is what we call skills. Okay. Many people can do the experiment. Ah, we can say that all of us can do the experiment. But the thing is they do it correctly or not ah that's why we, we are... don't do correctly if ah. it explode yeah <laughs> our cycle can explode that's why we have to learn about manipulative skills so that you you will know what is the right thing to do what is the thing that you can do what is the thing that you cannot do uh, okay so that's why we are learning about this part so that when you come okay. back to letter, if we do the experiment, you can teach us later. When you teach us, we could 
it will explode. Yes, if you focus in this class, okay, if you know what I'm writing to, inshallah, our science lab won't explode. Don't worry, okay? That's why in this world, okay, we have to try to do all the right things, right? Okay, so let's continue. Ah, the first one for manipulative skills is you need to handle the science and materials correctly. Ah. If you see in this picture, okay, this girl is wearing a white coat, okay, a uh, white coat. This is what we call a lab coat, okay, lab coat. So you need to wear a lab coat so that it can protect, okay, your clothes from the, ah, uh, from the material here. For example, we have the green solution, purple, orange, okay. So I when see. you wear, a, when you wear, yes. Okay, so make sure you wear My mommy is a scientist. Your mommy is a scientist. Yes. Uh, so when your mommy go to work, okay, she will wear a lab coat. Okay, this white coat here is what we call a lab coat. Okay, so ah, uh, you need to wear a lab coat in order for it to protect your clothes from any chemical here. Ah, the purple one, the green one is what we call chemical. Okay. All right. Next one. Okay, handling specimen correctly and carefully. Okay, teacher told you just now that I will share with you about what is specimen. Okay, for example, that day we are going to do the experiment about shape of leaf. Okay, shape of leaves. So the leaf, okay, the leaf is what we call specimen. What we want to do experiment, okay, the material for us to do the experiment that is what we call specimen, okay? For example, if that day we want to do the experiment about a snail, so that snail is what we call specimen, okay? Ah, all right, next one. Keeping science apparatus and materials correctly and safely. This one is very important, okay? You have to keep the science apparatus and also the materials for our yeah. experiment correctly. Yeah. Yeah? Yes. Yellow, yellow, blue, and pink. Yes. Ah, this one. Okay, the liquid here. Okay, liquid here is what we call chemicals and also materials. When we want to do the experiment, we have to keep them properly. Yes. Yes. So beautiful. Beautiful. Yes. In science, also. Uh, in science. Uh, we're going to see many beautiful and new things, okay? That's why teacher, teacher myself, I love science because I got to learn many new things. And I like a volcano. Volcano? <laughs> it's not that. A volcano. It's, it's not, not a volcano. A volcano is just a practice. Yes, this one is not a volcano. It's just have uh, the red and uh, yellow yeah, color because it's uh, chemical. Yes? Uh, okay, so let's continue. Next one. Drawing specimens, size materials and apparatus correctly. Okay, usually for experiment. Okay, after we're done the experiment. Sure. Yes? Sure. What they want to do. What they want to draw? Do. What they want to do here in the picture? In the picture, they are drawing. Ah, they are drawing the specimens after their experiment. Ah, wait, listen to teacher first. Okay. So for us, after we already done with the experiment, okay. So we will draw. Okay, we will draw about our experiment. All right. So um. Aside from drawing the specimen, we are going to draw the science apparatus that we use as well. Okay, it's okay if you guys are confused about this topic, don't worry, okay? It's okay if you guys are confused because this topic is supposed to be learned while doing the experiment. But for now, we are having online class, okay? So it's impossible for us to do the uh, experiment for the time being, all right? Don't worry. Um, inshallah, uh, when you guys can uh, 
uh, come back to school, teacher will uh, show you again about this topic, okay? It's okay if you guys are confused now, it's okay. Don't worry, okay? It's just that you need to know how to handle the science, exper uh, science experiment and the uh, apparatus correctly, okay? Uh, that is the most important thing first, okay? So after you already done drawing, after you already done your experiment, okay, uh, you have to wash the science apparatus, okay? You have to wash them carefully, okay? Uh, for example, just now teacher asked your friend, uh, if we already done eating, what should we do? Your friend said we can bring... Normal virus. Yes, uh, this one is... Teacher, the virus is... Here's the... They ice. Ah, okay. I microphone off first. Listen to teacher first. Thank you. Okay. So for the uh, experiment, after you already done with your experiment, you have to wash the size apparatus. Ah, for example, if you already done eating just now, you have to wash the plate as well. Let it dry. That's store them okay same goes to the size apparatus after you already done with your experiment you have to wash them okay wash them let it dry then after that store them okay so after you already done with all you need to wash your hand as well because we didn't know what is the bacteria okay uh, maybe the apparatus that we used just now is dirty so we have to wash our hand okay so, uh, can you guys take out your tatan book? Can you guys take out your tatan book? All right, today we are going to call you. Ah, yes, that one tatan book. All right. So, open your tatan book. Today we are going to. Yes, we only have science, a uh, one science tatan book. So, the tatan book uh, is the book that have two, uh, two cartoon. On the front page, one boy and one girl, okay? Yeah. Um, yes. If you draw on the draw, in the middle, there's a robot. Ah, okay, my uh, yes. <laughs> yes. Microphone off first, listen to teacher. Okay, so in our science tatan book today, since you guys cannot do the experiment at school, so we are going to sketch the science apparatus first, okay? Science apparatus so that ah, when we are about to do the experiment later, you will know. Oh, this one is a beaker. This one is the uh, test tube. Uh, we're going to sketch first. Wait for a while. Teacher, we share the screen with you again. Right. Teacher, which one? Uh, wait, wait. Teacher, we share the screen. Right there and there. First today is it the blue line or the blue line? Which one did you use for science last week? Use the same book that you used last week. My uh, class. Uh, it's okay. just today, Monday, eight February. Yes, correct. Okay, let's write day and date, everyone. And day. M O N -D. already done. Already done. Okay, so today. Sure. Yes, go to yes. Toilet. yes, you may go. Anyone who wants to go to the toilet, you may go first. No. No. <laughs> you don't want to go. Okay. So ah uh, the title for our Tatan book activity today is going to be Science, science apparatus. Ah, what is science apparatus? What is apparatus? Ah, so apparatus means the thing that you use for experiment. Okay, the thing that you use for experiment. So inside your tatan book, make sure you write number one like this. Number one. Ah, so let's see what we're going to sketch for our First one. All right. First one, we're going to sketch beaker. Ah, beaker I'm not done yet. Not done yet? Okay, you can continue. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't see what it was called. Ah, yeah, yeah. Science apparatus. Okay, you can write the title. 
Okay, so the first object is beaker. Anyone not done yet in writing the title? Done. Done. And done. Okay. So, I didn't write the title yet. Yes. I didn't write the title yet. Okay, write the title now. Okay, you can draw the skill for the beaker like this. And the next thing you need to do is write the name of this apparatus. Okay, so this is the thing that you use for experiment. So, we don't call it as this thing. We call it as this apparatus. Ah, so, apparatus is what you use for your experiment. I don't know how to draw apparatus. You don't know how to draw? Me too. Teacher, I know how to draw that. Okay, so teacher will draw once again. Uh, teacher will draw once again. Let's do it together with me, okay? Uh, ready with your pencil? Teacher will draw once again. All right. So what you need to do is like this. Just uh, first thing, draw it like you want to draw a cup first, like that. Okay, then do it like this. Okay, so next one, uh, you can. Did you like this? Wait, wait. Then. You cannot see you, wait. Okay, then do it like this, then uh, draw the scale. Ah, okay, like that. Okay, I see I'm done. Ah, okay, if you're done, wait, did you will move on to the next one. Okay, all right. So, second one, uh, write number two, then draw a circle like this, okay? So, for second one, we're going to sketch... You to go to the toilet. Okay, you may go test you. Uh, we're going to draw a test tube, okay? Alright, so test tube, you I draw... I don't to draw test tube, uh, okay. easy. Easy, alright, you can draw it, right? Do it like this. Then, draw one line below here. One more. Then draw it like this. Okay, there you go. Your test you. It's okay, even if we cannot do the experiment together yet. Let's know what is the size of the Teacher. Yes. I don't mean, know all of about the size. You you already what? I don't know all the signs. You already done all? I don't know. Yeah, no. yeah. Have you done sketching this inside your book? Yes. Can you show teacher your book? Teacher, I'm not done yet. I know, I know. Wait, wait for a while. Teacher will show you the screen again. Yeah, yeah. Where is the size apparatus? Yeah, yeah. Teacher, I already draw. Okay, we are going to draw four size apparatus. If and you are not done two, means you are not done yet. Wait for a while, okay? Wait, teacher will reshare the screen with you. We are going to draw four size apparatus today. Make sure you write the name of yes, the size I cannot. Well. Can you see my screen now? Okay, this one is the first one because second one test tube. Okay, the third one we are going to sketch about conical flex. Okay, conical flex. This one. All right. So let's do together with teacher. Teacher, I don't know. I do it done yet. Okay, if you're not done, it's okay. You can continue. Okay, that's how we draw conical flags. And make sure you write the name as well, okay? Don't just uh, don't just catch them. 
Make sure then you... I already did the name. Okay, good job. All right, number four, the last one. Number four, we are going to sketch glue. Okay, if you're not done yet, number three, you can continue. I'm showing you my screen now, so you can continue, no problem, okay? All right, so last one, we're going to sketch a glove. Mm. Why we need oh. a glove? Mm. To protect your fingers. How many fingers do we have? Ten. 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 Ten fingers. Eleven okay. fingers. I mean, five. Eleven. Okay, Eleven. so you can draw uh, like this, okay, miss? This hand is wearing glove. All right, there you go. Oh, did you don't have the space to write? I will write here. Okay, so for sketching, it's okay if you don't want to color them, but as for glove, okay, uh, because we want uh, we want to see the differences between the gloves and also your fingers so you can color the glove with blue uh, okay. yes um do we need to draw it with color color gloves only uh wait do we need to what my dear can you repeat your question again sorry do you need to what again Okay, wait, wait, everyone, microphone off. Uh, one student at a time, okay? If you guys are talking, all of you are talking at the same time, I couldn't understand you, all right? Okay, who asked teacher just now? Ask me. Do we need to draw big? Draw big? Uh, you can draw. You don't have to draw. You don't have to draw. Uh, so big. If you can fit four pictures, it's okay. Color the picture. Ah, the color. Yes, Sophia. Sophia, want to go to toilet? Yes, teacher. Okay, you may go. Yes. Can I color on? I already color on. You want to color 